Mid-engine AMG? 2023 Lotus Amira gets world's most powerful four-cylinder. The upcoming Lotus Amira will be the last combustion-powered sports car from the fabled British sports car maker, and they seem to be sorting out a very special tune to celebrate it. While many will be interested in the more powerful V6 model, the Lotus Amira will also adopt AMG's turbocharged 2.0-liter i4, which the company claims is the most powerful road-going 4 pot in the world. To equip it in a mid-engine sports car configuration is incredibly drool-inducing. The Amira will go on sale with either a 3.5-liter supercharged V6 sourced from Toyota, or AMG's 2.0-liter turbocharged i4, and both will be available in the first edition launch spec for the model. The blown V6 puts out just over 400 horsepower and 310 pound-feet of torque, but it's the fancy new four-cylinder that will get people talking. The Mercedes-AMG four-cylinder is already in production, found under the hoods of performance models such as the Mercedes-AMG CLA 45, GLA 45 and GLB 45, but Lotus says the engine will get a slight rework for the Amira's mid-engine configuration, as well as a unique software tune and Lotus-designed exhaust. The twin-scroll turbo design allows for minimum lag and faster spool-up, and puts out a whopping 182.5 horsepower per liter. The four-cylinder Amira is rated at 365 horsepower and shares the same 310 pound-feet of torque as the more expensive V6 Amira. The new i4 Amira will also get a new to Lotus 8-speed paddle shift dual-clutch gearbox. Gavin Kershaw, director, vehicle attributes, Lotus, says, it's a bespoke rear-wheel drive variant of the transmission developed by Lotus in collaboration with AMG. On top of that, the gearshift strategy has been defined by the Hethel team as part of the car's performance attributes. It is unique to the Amira and optimized, sick, for the best blend of outstanding driving engagement and performance, fuel consumption and emissions. The V6 Amira gets a six-speed manual box with the addition of a Torsen Limited Slip Differential, or the familiar six-speed auto found on previous Lotus cars. All first edition Amiras, which you'll be able to option with either motor, come with 20-inch ultralight forged alloy wheels in a V-spoke design that are diamond cut for a two-tone finish, but all silver or all black finish will also be available at no cost. Two-piece brake discs are available with red, yellow, silver or black calipers, with a tire pressure monitoring system included in the first edition package. Six paint colors are available at launch, Seneca Blue, Magma Red, Hethel Yellow, Dark Verdant, Shadow Gray and Nimbus Gray, paired with seven optional interior colors, red, black, gray and tan Napa leather, plus three black Alcantara options with either red, yellow or gray stitching. Interior trim is finished in satin chrome, and the seats are 12-way adjustable and heated with driver memory presets. This being Lotus, they felt the need to specify the car comes standard with climate control, cruise control, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, Bluetooth connectivity, a KEF-tuned digital radio behind a 10.25-inch screen, and a 12.3-inch driver display, and the Amira will not be available without these, for you lightweight purists, at least for now. The first edition comes with four normally optional packages already checked, the lower black exterior pack paints the lower features on the car black. The design pack adds privacy glass, new pedals, black Alcantara headliner, and throws in floor mats. The convenience pack adds parking sensors, a reversing camera, auto dimming mirrors with memory settings, and rain sensing wipers. Finally, the Lotus Drivers Pack offers customers the choice of tour or sport suspension tunes, and a choice of rubber between a set of Goodyear Eagle F1 Super Sport or Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires. You will have to pick if you order a first edition, so make sure you do your homework before ordering. The entry-level, AMG i4 Amira will start at $85,900 in the US for the first edition model, before factoring in local tax and destination costs. The V6 first edition with the manual is $93,900, and with the old 6-speed auto it's $96,050. The base V6 Amira will start at $82,000, and the rest of the Amira lineup pricing will be available this summer. Lotus promises more details on the new lineup this summer, when customer reservations become available outside of the UK. Deliveries are anticipated to begin by the end of this year, and you can now play with the Amira configurator on the Lotus website in the meantime.
Pricing details are now available across the entire Amira lineup, the last gasoline-powered Lotus before the brand transitions to a purely electric portfolio. Two powertrain options are available, including a supercharged 3.5-liter Toyota V6 or a 2.0-liter Mercedes AMG M139 turbocharged four-cylinder. Now, though, Lotus has also shared pricing for its special first edition model, which starts at $85,900. At its heart, the M139 engine makes 360 horsepower and 317 pound-feet of torque. While it's 40 horsepower from the larger V6, it actually packs a bit more torque, so the performance figures are nearly identical. At least, that's the case on paper, the V6-powered Amira sprints from 0 to 60 in 4.2 seconds. The four-cylinder will do it in 4.3 seconds. Top speed? That will be 180 for the V6, and 176 miles per hour for the AMG-powered model. That engine is mid-mounted in this application, of course, and comes with AMG's 8-speed dual-clutch transmission. If you spec the V6 version, you'll have the option of either a 6-speed manual or 6-speed automatic, 